Greetings, Zero here. Welcome back to the Seal Mod type run of EV Emerald. Last time, we almost beat our record for the longest episode in the series after battling a lot of trainers on one of the game's many water routes. No more backtracking for now, though. It's time to move on to the other half of Hoenn. First, we talk to this guy. This is how you get the good rod. See, there might be some other items around here. In fact, I'm pretty sure are. Also, yeah, there's... There's these two again. We can battle them again. Let's see. Who are we gonna use? Yeah, might as well. Gabby and Ty. Down you go. Pull up. Well, fuck you too. And you're down. Ah, eh, sure. Let's see. Nah. Hmm. Decisions, decisions. You two are a pair of drooling idiots, how about that? And now we get to this guy. Oh wait, I think... Did I remember to, to treat the paralysis or not? Eh, doesn't really matter. No, I didn't. Alright, let's... Let's just take care of that real quick, because that's going to get annoying if I don't. <clears throat> Down you go. And down you go. Nope. No hidden items. And there's Steven! Yeah, I know. Sorry, don't have any more letters for you, kiddo. Oh, don't worry, I'm sure we will. Oh. I guess these berries, uh... Oh, citrus berries. Eh, I'll be back to pick these up later. This could be useful, situationally. Now, we could just go north right away, but... There's... We're actually gonna go east first. Just do a little bit more training and also get some berries from the Berry Master's place. And 
you go. Yeah, right. Yeah, I can miss. So could Seal Wing, but whatever. Did I pick up anything? Nope. Here we have a hyper potion that can come in handy. Before we proceed, well, first we deal with this guy, whatever it is. Okay, now we move on. Recognize this music? Um, well, probably not if you've only been watching the playthrough because I skipped that section, but this is the music you hear when you start a new game. Brother got you a pincer, huh? Cool. Not quite. Oh, the cool trainer healed her partner. Okay. Whole lot of good that did ya. Now is another trainer. This isn't the last trailer on the route, there's a pair of twins further to the east. Actually, there's a lot more trailers on this route, but this section that you can actually access from the west is relatively small. Okay, so this segment's coming up at around 9 minutes, and uh, we're going to cut in a second. And we're back. So, there's a lot of berries here. This is where I usually go to plant berries that I'm using for various things like, you know, uh, whatchamacallit, if I'm making poffins for contests or if I'm farming, say, lepa berries so I can restore my power points. Because, of course, you got all. You just have a lot of berry patches here. And it's not that hard to get here either, because you can either fly to Mauville City and just go east to surf, or you can, uh, well, you can fly to Lily Coast City, go past Mount Pyre, and take the long way. Yeah. 
In fact, I think we are gonna plant some berries while we're here. I almost have to remember that they're here. Some of these may come in handy if I do end up reaching the sub goal by the end of this, because, again, if I get 10 subs on YouTube or 10 follows on Rumble, by the time I beat Steven, um, not when, not by the time I finish recording it, but by the time that episode airs, then I will go back and do each of the contest categories as well. Let's see, what do we got? Plant some Lepa Berries. Oh, and sometimes it rains on this route, so that can take care of the watering occasionally for you. Let's see. Anything else I might want? Yeah, might as well plant some of these. And there we go. Holes are filled up. Now we can go in here, and daily, you can talk to both of these people to get berries. This guy on the left gives you two berries a day. And this lady over here, well, if you s say, s well, you can tell her a phrase made of two words using the easy chat say, um, system, and she'll give you a berry. It's usually random based on if you say most things, but if you say specific phrases, she'll give you certain rare berries. Like for example, uh, one of them, one of the past phrases that gives you a rare berry is "cool latios." Of course, I. Haven't seen Latios, so I can't actually say that. Um, give me a second. I'm gonna go look it up real quick, just like so I can give you an idea of what it, what happens. Okay, here's one such saying: "Great battle." And in turn, she gives you a spell on Barry. I think these are only one time each. And now there's... Well, first of all, there's an item here. Ultra Ball. Good shit. Let's see, did I pick up... Oh! Also got something from Bitch here. Super Potion. Okay, I'll take those. <laughs> Me crying when I lose. I think this is what we call projection. And foreshadowing. And, well, mm-hmm. So yeah, that's as far as we can go from this side. To check out the rest of the route, we'd have to come back the other way. We're gonna go back to Marvel City real quick, just to heal up and do some other things. Among the things we did is we swapped out the mock bike for the acro bike. We're gonna need that. There are actually certain segments of the upcoming routes where the acro bike is useful. I still think the mock bike is generally more useful, but it's also more of a pain in the ass to use, casually. 
Okay. And now we come up to this segment. It's often raining here. And there are these trainers with bug Pokemon that will kind of mimic your movements, but not really. Of course, unfortunately for them, I'm using a Skarmory. I should also note, um, something fun you can do. Give me a second. Uh, if I recall correctly, if you cut the grass around them, the trainers won't move. So, let's just see what happens if I do that. So yeah, if you, if you want to troll the Mimic Circle trainers, just cut all the grass around them! They can't move, they'll just spin in place! Okay, we take those. Yeah, me too. Nope. There are some hidden items around here. Just not in that corner, I guess. Super Repel. That'll come in handy later. Okay. Can't argue with that logic! Yeah, I am. Glad you noticed. Correct me if I'm wrong, isn't she the one that said something kind of creepy when we met? Or am I thinking of a different trainer? Oh, there's Lainu in the evolved form of Zigzagoon. You actually survived the hit. You know what? I will catch this one. It'll just be another HM slave. It's a higher level than any of the Zigzagoon I have, but it's more just because it learns a couple of extra HMs that Zigzagoon can't, like strength. Now, it's not a steel type, but we are going to give it 
a uh, metal name. Specifically, we are naming it after a band called Striper. Um, let me put it this way. They are basically a Christian metal band. And, well, it, it they're better than they sound, seriously. It's, don't knock it till you try it. And there's only a couple more trainers left. Down you go. Okay, just making sure there's no one down here. No, thank you. Go away. And there's Surskit. Um, Surskit, by the way, you can actually get very early in the game. I think it's on Route 102? Um, they're very, very rare. Actually, more rare than Ralts. But you can find them there. Actually, hang on. I thought there might have been another hidden item. Whatever. It's not what I wanted. I wanted an item. Ah, oh, fuck it. Just fuck it. Um... Yeah, we've been at this for a while. The later routes in the second half of the game are very long. So... Well, we're just gonna battle one more trainer, I think, and then we'll wrap it up. Also, it's getting close to another 10 minute mark, so I'm just gonna cut this real quick. Oh, and I should note, this is actually the route where you find Feebas, although it is a really, really obnoxious Pokemon to try and get. You have to be in very specific spots to find it. A lot of ROM hacks will actually change that, because otherwise it's just ridiculous to try and get yourself a Feebas at all. But oh, it gets worse. You want to evolve it, you need to max out its beauty by feeding it dry poppins, so 
basically, if it's of a nature that doesn't like dry food, uh, you may not be able to evolve it at all. Otherwise, it's marginally better than Magikarp. Alright. Zinc. Boost your special defense. Okay. I don't want to use it or not. Nah, I don't think so. Swim back over here. And I think that's... That's gonna be it for now. Or... Nobody asked you! Go away! Anyway, I think that's gonna be a wrap for this time. If you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, check out my Rumble page. Remember, I've got a sub goal where if I get 10 subscribers on YouTube or 10 followers on Rubble, I will, after I beat Steven, go back and do all five of the contests and try and win the Master Rank. So, uh, I'll see you all next time.